feature presentation. All right. Yeah, it's really awesome to talk to you. <laughs> <clears throat> so the first question I wanted to ask, I was reading the production notes and it says that this was the right time to tell this story and to tell this moment in Jamaican history, but also your father's story. So I wanted to know a little bit more about why this was the right time to tell the story of Bob Marley, but also this moment in Jamaican history. Well, the, the, more, the period I chose for, as a foundation for tell the story was a very... Um, it changed his life. It made him who we, who we know him as today. This period of time was what really made him come to a conclusion within himself, which he says in an interview um, after the whole assassination attempt and stuff, he was speaking and he said that his life is not just for him. If it's just for him, he doesn't want it, right? So for a human being to come to that conclusion about his own life, that if it's just for him, he doesn't want it, he must have went through some stuff that is life-changing and it defined who he is, you know? So that's why we, we, we took this time period to tell the story because this is the time period that defined that he came to his own consciousness, to his own realization of what, what his purpose was and who he is as a person. His life is not just for him, it's for people. If it's just for him, he doesn't want it. That's life changing. And for say, well, we never choose for release the movie this time. Like it's not a thing where we did plan say, yeah, February 14, 2024, we're going to release a movie. So the timing really happened um, in, a, in a natural way, in a natural way, with the way things happen with us. And it is the right time for it to happen now. Um, the message of One Love is what we are trying to spread to the world, humanity. The state of the world today is in disarray. It's too much division, too much cultural division, political division, religious division, wars and violence. And there is no one in the political sphere, the religious sphere, the cultural sphere, any sphere that is putting forward a message to the people that they must unite. That we need, the more unity we have is more prosperity we will have as a, as, a, as a planet, as a species. This is what is doing it, this movie. And that is the most important thing about it and why now is the right time. Because it's, nobody else has the message out there. A Bob still I carry this message and the world need it. Well, especially in this day and age, I wanted to ask you about, I think it's so important that you mentioned that, you know, what Bob Marley means to so many people, but for you, how important was it to see him as a man, as your father, as somebody that, you know, had, you know, a, a life of his own and not just simply an icon? Yeah, well, it's important because, I mean, especially for another generation will come up, because we always like idolize things and idolize people, but... For understand that the humanity within us all is what connects us, not the idol, not the, not the imagination of who we are, but who we are as people. It is that, that really connect with. So for me, for sure, that humanity of my father, in a way, that brings him closer to us, that show him real, that, you know, as a man who can, if I have to fight him, or fight him. You know, as a man, he has jealous, you know, he's, he's, a, he's, a, he's a man like we, he just bring us closer to him. I make him realize, say, yeah, it's not like you need a special, a special person for love people or for have the idea for unify people. We can do that too. You know, you don't have to be like some kind of superhuman being. You can be a normal human being with normal emotions and still have the 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 the, the drive for help people out. You know. Uh, thank you so much. I have to wrap, but thank you so much for taking the time to just talk to me about the film and the work that you're doing, and I really thank appreciate you. it. Thank you. Thank you so much. <laughs>